here we are. It's another morning. It's a sunny day. I've got all my saws and everything out. We are going to make a crow platform today for our sky puppies. It's going to be right there on the fence. Are you ready, Coda? <gasps> are you ready, Buffy? For food? Sure. I like food. So we're going to make a skinny version of a crow platform. Um, this right here is something that we found at Lowe's that's definitely more, it's not floppy like the plastic stuff that we found yesterday. And the holes are just a little bit bigger, but not too big. Because uh, Angie brought it to my attention and I agree that the plastic may have actually retained water due to water tension. What are you eating? Buffy. <laughs> I'm over here, Buffy. <laughs> what are you eating? Crazy. Oh, Sky Puppy. Unsalted peanuts. Sky Puppy. Noise. And toss cookies. And there they go. Hi, puppies. So anyway, um, this right here, I'm going to straighten out. Uh, we'll cut it probably almost in half. And then I will take some of this uh, trim that they used when they made our windows. This is uh, excess. I will cut this probably down to like this and then I will put a notch in it all the way down so that this will actually like fit into the notch and that's what's going to hold the mesh into the the box part. By the use of some cardboard and a 2 by 4 I was able to straighten this out. So there's step one and I've marked my line and where I'm going to cut it. Holy cow, this is the first honeybee of the season. Look at that. Wow. Seems like it's too early to me. I guess that's good to see though. Anyway, um, so uh, here we go. Uh, the slot has been made so that this is going to fit into the slot all the way around. That's what's gonna hold this in. See, right there. You get this, Buffy? You got it? You got it? Yeah? And a little bit of sawdust, a little bit of screwing and drilling and chopping, and there we go. There is our crow tray. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? All right. So Angie's going to paint this up, and I'm going to clean up. Angie's still going to paint it, but I've got all the bracing up, and this just, like, pops up, comes off very easy. Hi, buddy. There's more right here. <laughs> it's awesome. All right, now we'll see if they take to it or not. So guys, just when we think that the closet is done, it's not. See this piece right here? There was this gap up, up above the door frame here. And after I got done with the uh, crow platform, I asked Angie, it's like, uh, do we need to cut anything else before I put the saws away? And she says, oh yeah, that piece above there. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm doing that. Angie's over here doing this. <laughs> Getting the door all prepped for paint. There's aliens in here. Yeah, aliens all over the place. Look at this. Oh my gosh, okay, so. Angie's gonna be going to the school tomorrow and decorating uh, the office, right? Back up, back up. No, we're doing, um... back up. We have a book fair, so the front entrance has to be like readings out of this world or something like that. So I've got the moon down below and then, or a, a planet with like craters and stuff, and then we're gonna have goofy aliens floating around. And no Chinese air balloons? No. 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 <laughs> and then in the older kids' hallway, we're gonna put some little astronauts. So how much space. work do you have to do tonight? Uh, just maybe two more of these. Oh, okay. I thought that you had like a lot more to do. Well, no, I'll probably do a little, little bit all week. No, yeah. that's so awesome. So yeah, so she's doing that, and oh, uh, the crow. You is this done being painted? No. No. Nope. Oh, just the first coat. So these little legs right here latch onto the fence so that it can't go this way and this one right here just supports it on the lower part of the fence so it just sits there there's no harsh connecting or anything 
we just go out there and hang it on the fence and it's all done. So it's got, I don't know what, like another coat. Yeah. Probably. Awesome. Alrighty. So, um, oh, uh, Maria Ricca, uh, you were asking about, uh, if your stuff has got here yet. Um, I don't know when you sent it, but from Canada, it can take up to like three weeks or so. It takes a really long time to get across the border. And yeah. I did check, um, when did I check? Friday? Thursday. Thursday or Friday? I think it was Friday. I think it was Friday. Yeah, Thursday or Friday I checked because I was at the post office. So don't panic. It'll probably be here. Everything will be fine. But I'll check again middle of next week. So uh, with that being said, I guess it's kind of a short vlog today. I didn't film that much, although what I filmed was more interesting than me driving around talking in the truck as I'm going to different jobs. So there is that. So, hey Coda, you want to say goodnight? Mm. Are you sure? No. no. You just want to drink your water? Uh -huh. Where's your diaper? Uh, <laughs> In the closet? Did you already eat dinner? Uh, no, no, I, I did not have dinner. <laughs> Very hungry. <sighs> okay. All right, guys. Um, that's it. Happy morning. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night.